Hey everybody, me and Buster want to say welcome to Little Cahaba Junkin, where we share a whole lot of junkin and even more Jesus. Enjoy our video. Hey everybody, it's me Kayla and welcome back to our channel. Today I have a very special treat for everyone. You've all heard the stories of the beautiful little house that is curated and just taken care of by our friend Angie Barnett and her beautiful mother Mary. This little house sits on their property and it's absolutely filled to the brim with vintage and primitive and antique items. Walking in this house just takes you a step back in time to when things were simple. People just enjoyed the small blessings of every day and life was a lot less complicated. This house is full of beautiful treasures that have been gathered for many years and each one holds a very special story. I'm so thankful that they allowed us to come in and take a look around today. I absolutely love it and I know that you're going to love it as well. So make sure you tell them below how much you appreciate letting us come by. Hello! Special, special delivery, special guest. Hey, welcome to my little house, Kayla. Come on in. Well, I am so excited. Hey, y'all. And this is a face that y'all recognize, Miss Angie Barnett. And this is her precious mama. I'm going to let her introduce herself. Uh, my name is Mary. And uh, this is my daughter, and she does a lot of this stuff out here. I'm, I'm the helper. You're, don't, you're, don't you're. Let her fool me. I'm you're, very you're the, humble. She's very humble, but she's got an eye like a hawk for this kind of you're, stuff. You're, you're the finder, aren't you, Miss Mary? Yeah, Mary's? I do. I find a lot of stuff, and then you know, uh, if my neighbors around, they'll give me something. Say, hey, put this in your little house, and I'll yes. say, okay. Well, so this is a little house that's on their property that's kind of, all y'all live he right here together. We are on the compound, as we said before, when y'all came to see my Christmas things. My mom and dad um, just live right in front of this little house, and then my sister and her husband are behind us, and I'm on the other side, and then I have a sister-in-law, so yes, it is a compound. And we, we and I, would, I wouldn't have it any that's other way. exactly right. And so y'all just use this as y'all's little treasure trove. This is our little treasure house that when Mama buys something or me too, we can come hide it. And our husbands don't really, I mean, they don't know. And <laughs> we, we have a fun time of uh, just, you know, just a place to put it. Well, it's beautiful, and I know everybody's going to be so excited that they're actually getting to see it because everybody's heard the stories of Angie and Mary's little house. Well, look, we love to junk, and I told y'all in, in my Christmas video of her brother, Bobby Joe, had a little shop in town, and he got us started with this bug, and it has just gone from there. And, Mama, how many years have you collected, would you say? All my life, probably. Yeah, so almost, I wouldn't even say her age, but a long time, several decades <laughs> of collecting, so. And but this is stress-free out here. That's right. Yes, it is. This, this I is, leave my worries uh, out at home mm -hmm. and then come out here and it's stress-free. That's right. Yes. And I'm just so glad that y'all are letting us come take a look around and I'm going to let y'all just kind of show us everything and tell us some of your favorite pieces and Everybody's just going to get so excited. <laughs> and look, she does not like to talk at all. I'm she gonna let, I'm she gonna wants her. and I... Well, I'm just so glad Miss Mary's actually getting on camera. I was this, shocked this, when this, I seen her come. Huge for her. But, yes. Um, my mother is a master yard seller, a flea market, thrift store. And like she said, people just give her stuff because they, they know that she values antiques. She loves antiques and they love... For her to have them so she can tell the story of, hey, my friend or my sister or whoever gave it to her. And then that way, it's just a great thing to have to remember people, even when they pass yes. out. She's told me stories of her sister-in-law that's given her stuff. So, But just take, for example, the, the mantle here. Um, Mom and I both went to, I think we saw it in the mule trader years ago. This little house has been here almost 30 years. We were trying to figure out when they built it. It's been almost 30 years. 
And we went to Pea Ridge and we got this mantle from a little old lady. You remember that, Mama? Oh, yeah. And if y'all don't know, the Mule Trader is our little circulating paper that we use to look for. We, they sell livestock. They yes. sell antiques. That They uh, advertise yard sales. A little bit of everything. It's the old-fashioned way. Instead of going online, you can still look in the Mule Trader. But anyway, we went and got this mantle. And then, I mean, the ladies... This, this little lady's house was falling in, and we drug it out, had some help to go, and um, that was, you, there's just so many stories behind it, but then her neighbor, she had neighbors over here that have uh, recently passed away, and they had, I mean, they gave her so much stuff before they, you know, just during the years, and that's how she remembers them, and that's right. just a lot of stuff, but as you can see, it's fun to put it together in a little uh, vignette. And then at Christmas, you know, we do some decorating. Not as much as we do like at our own houses, but um, it is fun. It's like her little dollhouse, I guess you would say, to come and well, it's, fix it up. I, I need me one. Every woman needs a she shed or a little cottage house or something. That's yes. You really do. <laughs> Just to unwind. That's exactly right. And the pie safe that you see here, that was a marketplace find. Um, a lady had it, and I think we went to Pelham. 50 bucks, she said. She'll <gasps> come get it today. So, <laughs> we had this going, and what the quilts, a the quilts I know, look, the quilts in it are um, family quilts, or neighbor's quilts, or just quilts we picked up at yard sales. Because who does not love a quilt? Oh, that's a beautiful book, Who too. does not love a quilt? Think of the work that went behind all those little stitches that went in that, and it is an it's an, that's an art form. Yes, it is. It and is an art form. Not a lot of people do it anymore. No, they don't. Or at it's least not of, like these. Exactly. Exactly. And then I don't know if y'all know what these are right up here, but those are, Mama, tell them what those are. Rug beaters. Rug beaters. When you want to well, your rug. that's a little bitty rug beater. That's a little tiny one. That's a dollhouse rug <laughs> I beater. That's what it was for. That's so cute. Um, I love them. I, I have a couple. before what those were, and she said, those are rug beaters. I, I love it. And I told Angie and Miss Mary, I want a big basket like this. And I saw one this last weekend, and I should have purchased it, but I didn't. You know, when your gut tells you you need it, you might as well go ahead and pick it up. That's right. Because you, you, you'll regret it if you don't. And I do. So, I'm going to have to find me one. <laughs> and I love that, all the detail on that lamp. That's you so You know pretty. what? We had a sweet family member, Miss mm -hmm. Jess. Jess. Jess, we call her. Um, Mama's nephew's wife. That she just gave it to Mama. She knows Mama loves antiques. And she's, she's always giving her stuff very sweet. And this piece is beautiful, too. That's one oh. of her favorites. She will tell you, Mama. Where'd you find this at, Miss <laughs> Mary? I got that down at... Um, what used to be, uh, what is that? It's Wren Wheels, is that yes, what Yes, Wren Wheels. Mm -hmm. uh, this lady had a shop in there or a booth, and uh, she had it for sale, so I bought it. It's huge. It's huge. It's huge. I, how did y'all get it home? It's one piece. Well, my son went and took a trailer down there and put it on a trailer. That took a bunch of men, yeah, a yeah, big man hauling that. And all I wonder what it was in before, you know. I just wonder. Like I just some, wish we could get yes. the history behind it because, you know, it looks like almost like a butler's pantry, huge piece. Yes. And, you know, just don't know. Did y'all paint it red or was it red when y'all bought it? No, I painted it. It was uh, a, a brown looking piece and uh, I saw another cabinet painted like a plum granite. Yeah. And it, I love that color. So that's well, it is pretty. beautiful. Y'all's old phone. I love that too. And most of these pictures are these just pictures that y'all find, or they're not? Are they family? Or no. that's like me. Some. I wish we had family pictures, but that's like me. Everybody says at my job, they say you've just got all these random people on your walls. And somebody recently said, "Well, you're just giving them a home." That's exactly right. Providing a family. That's right. I, um, I bought that in. Um, and it may be a reproduction, I don't know. But yeah, but why I bought it is because what dress she has on, 
is what I have. Uh, yeah, and you'll see like in a minute, here. it does look a lot like a um, dress. You, when you see this dress, <laughs> it's amazing. Yes. And this way, is this, is that built in or is that just, or that's just, just, no, it's just a corner. Yeah, just yes. a little bit well, just it corner cabinet. Looks perfect, matches just perfect. It does. Oh, Penny's bowls. Is that her bowl? She loves these kind of bowls, yeah, let's like open this it. one up there. You can see. Yes. Yeah, there we go. She actually, I think, has that one up there on the right. Oh, those are so sweet. And these little molds. I, I have those little molds. I, for some yes, reason. I, mean, I, I have several of them. I never know what to do with them, so I, I need to get them out and display them. Yeah, just put them in a little trinket box or a basket. And, and Miss Mary is also a really good cook. And now, didn't she? Didn't you used to make cinnamon rolls and stuff out here? I did. Yep, she was a lunchroom worker for how many years, Mama? Eighteen. 18. Yes, I remember Miss Mary working in that lunchroom mm -hmm. when I was there. I sure do. And her mama, Miss uh, Mama Ollie, was such a good cook. So she learned from the best. That's why we're all chubby in our family because we like to eat it. Well, you, you <laughs> preaching to the choir over here because y'all know we love to eat. Yes. And look at this old stove. That's so pretty. And then you'll notice behind you going up these steps. When you turn and look, we just use that for storage upstairs, but um, you could use it for a living space, but we yeah. use it for storage. So when we, you know, move things around, we can take it up there and it's full. <laughs> it's full, we always say. I hope the, the, these floor joists up here hold. Yes, and look but at all that cast iron. Up there. Yes, it's beautiful. Got a spinning wheel. I think she got that in Cleveland, Tennessee years ago. She had it in the den in here, but the kids want to spin it around. We were afraid they would break it because it's very fragile. But she loves, you can tell, cast iron. Yes, look at all those. Loves cast iron. And some of our, our collection is so different because I don't care for cast iron. So when we're looking, we don't have to worry about me fighting over something with her, you know, saying, oh, I want that. But now some things we do. Well, see, now me and are, Penny like the same stuff. Yes, and it's hard <laughs> when you're with a collector that likes the same thing because when you see it and you want it, it's hard when someone else does too. But look, we know we can share it. That's right. We can share it. That's why I need to have me a compound. Yes, you do. So, you and Penny have got to, like, have a comp. She, she yes. Like to move toward this yes. Well, you know, I told her I was going to be the one taking care of her. That's exactly So, I right. said, I'll just move her in there with me. Yes. Me, her, and Debbie Jean will just live all together. And that would be looking. Y'all would get along fine. Yes, we would. And all your Crocs. Those are beautiful. And that's Butcher Block right there, isn't it? That is Butcher Block. <sighs> we had it toward so the center, pretty. but it, it just gets in the way sometimes. That is gorgeous. Little house antiques. Yes. Did y'all have that made or did y'all find My that? My sister got it for her for uh, Christmas one year. And um, we, we we actually found it when we were cleaning some stuff in here. And she had it in a paper still wrapped. I said, Mama, we got to get that out and put it up so Daddy was sweet. Our Daddy, again, Daddy is our little go-to man. That yes. Our stuff together. And oh my gosh, that scale. Isn't I that love beautiful? that. Oh. I borrowed that actually. If you'll go back and look at my video at Christmas, I, I borrowed yep. that. Y'all see why I said I kept, I borrowed from my mama because she's got it all. Yes, she does. She loves rolling pins too. And well, I do too, so I might just have to get me a few. And that little bean pod candle cabinet, uh, when the Jemison Trade Center was open and they, they had a booth going out of business, uh, I told you know when Mama got, it, I was like, Mama, why do you want that bean pod candles? But let me just tell you, that's the most beautiful thing. Yes, and look how it beautiful is. it is with that little. Yes. And, and advertising too. Absolutely, we're gonna spin. I love the door, I love all of it. I think Daddy actually made the doors in here for Mama so they would look um, vintage. And she's got it shut, but let me show y'all in the back that I love this. It's just the little things that she does that I just love. Yes, little oh. thing in right with all of her, um, all of her, her aprons. I love it. It's just, it just works. And she can call y'all to come eat. Yeah. <laughs> She's got a cowbell. That's right. Now the kids love to ring that. It can't I get bet they do. Do, what, you, do. Do you know what this is? I was just about to ask you, Miss Mary, what is that? It's a, it's a quilting rack. <gasps> it sure is. Look at that. Mm -hmm. 
That is Do gorgeous. You, uh, well, you probably don't remember when uh, Mr. Hadley had his antique store over here in Thoris. Mm -mm, I don't. don't. You probably, I bet he would remember it. Oh. Uh, I, I, I got it from, I bought it over there. And it's been hanging here for 30 years. I love it. I can't believe this house has been out here for 30 years. I know. We were trying to add it up, and I, it was been, you know, Katie was uh, little bitty, and she, but it's been almost 30 years. Yeah, because I'm 32, mm -hmm. and... And if y'all don't know, my mother lives right down the street. She's our so sweet, yeah. sweet mother. I grew up with these ladies. Mm -hmm. And their daughter, Katie, and y'all would love Katie because she is <laughs> a mess. I told you, too. Remember, I told you Katie's even starting to get interested in Yes, him. well, good. Mainly the vintage holiday. but Well, I know she's good. And y'all said Ollie was who now? That's my mother's uh, mom. That's my mother. Yes, mm -hmm. that's hung, right. That hung in her kitchen. Mm. And, uh, that's I, I, sweet. I, got that. I love it. And now we are in the next room. Y'all, this is just a giant treasure trove. This is one of her favorite things to collect. Uh, Mama, come in here now, because some of this stuff I may not tell about. But come on, Miss Mary. kitchenware stuff. And I'm telling y'all, she has the best luck at finding bowls and things that, you know, in an antique shop would be... 60 to 70 dollars and she'll say look i found this at so and so for a dollar i, I know kind of it look. me either but she uh, she 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 goes a lot so well it's it's a there's worse habits you could have miss mary exactly right. we call I it junk and therapy don't we, Mama? yeah junk and therapy it is therapy because i tell therapy. you i ain't never been sad in a flea market no, exactly well unless right. unless I, I can't afford something it, i really yes, want when you see something and you see the price tag and think no i can't have and uh, even Emmy Kate now, Katie's little mm -hmm. girl, she loves, she so loves, we, we love, like we it. creating a little junker with Well, Katie good. Long. And y'all, y'all would love that sweet <laughs> baby because she is precious. She loves to go junking. And just all and I, crazy. How long have you had that Hoosier cabinet? You've had that a while, haven't oh, you? Well, I don't know how And I love the jade dot in it. We did, when we were organizing it, you know, uh, couldn't really figure out what to put in it, but I love that J. -Dye yes, there. it pops against it. And her little egg holders. I didn't realize she had that many. They're all so pretty. And this is what, Mama, tell them what this is right here, over here when Kayla spins around this way. Okay. This white mm -hmm. piece. Of this that piece is here, uh, the people that used to live over here in Mr. Uh, Ellie Pound's old home house, and, and they they moved and this was uh she kept her her groceries in it but it's it's original a little chicken thing it's a chicken coop. that is um, precious is that not neat i love that i've tried to get it two or three times but <laughs> she ain't she no, said no nope. mama my shiny brights would be so pretty in yes it would she said no nope. i love my cookie cutters in there yes oh you can store a lot of stuff it, in yes there. And still see it. Exactly. Let me. I told y'all before on a video that their house is almost like a cracker barrel over here. There's so much to see. You have to really look. Mm -hmm. But this is this is much better. One of these days they're gonna come out here and Miss Mary's gonna say so and so's missing, and they'll see they'll see my trap marks out there where I've spill, spun out to get away. And this was on your table, wasn't yes, it, for that your is tour? The one that I had borrowed to put um, the ornaments in, and we actually were out um, junking this past week, and we saw two that weren't even half that size, and we flipped the price tag over $500. I believe it. I could not believe it until Mama said, I, there's no telling what that would cost now. I couldn't afford it now, but. That right there would probably cost uh, probably $800. That's what I told her. It's just unreal. I didn't realize they were that expensive. People, people have really got to where they love primitive and, yes. and vintage stuff. And again, good pieces are really, really difficult for, especially for primitives, because that's what I really love is our primitives. And they are beautiful. And I love that scale. I love everything red. I, do like, I love red in a scale. I don't know why. I guess because you could use it for Christmas, and it's just, it's real pretty. 
And then look, she, these, I, where did you get these, your ovens, mama? Didn't you travel far to get one? Or? I never got uh, where we went. It was way down below Montgomery. Mm -hmm. But this one, look now, I got this local. Look, the old timey stove there. And she was talking about it, and I had told her, Mom, it takes up so much space. You, I'm not getting rid of that one of these days. We're going to need that. Yes, you will. The way will. this world's going, we may have to use it. So That's right. That is awesome. For now, we're gonna look, we're gonna think how pretty it is, but it'll be here if y'all need it. Exactly right. And look, she's got little bitty stuff that I mean, it's just, it's just a lot, but it's a it's a good stuff to have. It is. <laughs> it's a good lot of stuff to have. What, what is what is this? Just a chair that flips into a table? Mm -hmm. or? Yes, it's a tea table. Oh, I love and that. And the, the top flips down, and then it's got the little pegs that go in there. Yeah. And we've tried to look them up before, and just really can't find a whole lot of information on them. But it's a neat piece, because see, it's out of the way till you need it, and then you can yes. flip it over. Yes. And I love all your mannequins dressed up. They are so sweet. I told her you had one named after your grandmother. I is do. Esther Ruth. Esther Ruth, Esther I do. Ruth. I said we could call that one Ollie. That's right. This oh, is Ollie. Yeah. That's, that's <laughs> all the bonnets. And yeah, the all of these bonnets in here are my mama's mama's bonnets that she'd wear in the garden. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Isn't that just the sweetest? Yes, it is. Because my mom, now, she meant she wasn't going to get blistered. And she didn't. She was scared of skin cancer. so she. Well, that's a smart thing to do. She the hat and the long sleeves on when her and Papa worked in the garden. Well, that's a good thing to do because yes. it's, because I, I need to do better, take better care of my skin, too. And y'all, even their bathroom is beautiful. I love that tub. And she got that tub down at Vida, Alabama. They have a um, auction. It, once a year, you and Penny need to go to that. Yes. They have an auction for their, is it their fire department to raise money or just the town or something? But um, I love She that. called me and said, well, I bought me a closet tub. I said, for what? To have. Put it in my little house. To have, yep, and it enjoy does. it. It worked out well. That's so Daddy crazy. actually had the water hooked up. So, if we so it to, works. If we get in a bind, I guess we can come right on out here and take a bath at the little house. I'd live out here. And I told her they actually thought about moving out here, but I said, but mom, if you move out here, then you really, it's not a place to go to. It's just every day. She said, I know. <laughs> That's right. But it is cozy. It just makes you feel good to come out here. Yes, it does. This is the last little room, so we just made a little circle, but this one is one of my favorites. Mine too, and um, vintage clothing. Mama has always loved vintage clothing, but if you, that picture she was talking about just a minute ago. Yes. This dress, look, look. she normally keeps it up in this because, you know, you don't want it to fade, but when the Jemison Trade Center was here, we've got some really good things out of that. And I, see, I just, I used to go there all the time, but I didn't care. I wasn't that's looking for this were, stuff. That's right. Yes, I was looking for stupid stuff. I don't know. I wasn't looking for all this stuff. It's probably, I would say, at least 20 years ago that you bought this, would you say? Or mm -hmm. longer now. It could be. But I, she came home and she said, I had to have it. And she said, I know I probably paid more than I should have. But she said, that's gone with the wind. I was, I said, just, I was just about to say, Scarlett. Okay, everybody look. Look at this waist, what you would have had to have to get in that dress. That, I mean, that, that that's the size 16 of 16 inches around. That's the they size of my thigh. That, look, I couldn't probably even get my legs. Maybe. But, <laughs> but it's just beautiful. Yes, it is. It I is mean, gorgeous. it looks just like something Scarlett O'Hara would have wore. Know, we would really probably... If, if, I wish we had the history behind it because I don't know if it was a like a real dress they wore or somebody made it as a costume. I don't know. Well, it's, it's gorgeous. It's ma it's well made. Yes. And I love this picture of this little girl right here. Isn't that the sweetest? It looks kind of like Katie's baby and a little bit. She looks like yeah. Emily Kelly. Yes, she, she does. does. Isn't that she crazy? <laughs> And I love all your baby gowns. I have a bunch at home, and I never really know what to do with them. Oh, but I love baby gowns. You need to find you. A, 
don't you have a wardrobe and you can hang some yes, up in there? Yes, I do. That's what I need to and do. Look, most of these are the local, just from little yard sales and things. And that one is precious. Isn't that I not just the sweetest? Love that. Oh. That's when children dress really just those older vintage pictures. Yes. Just so classy and just so and handmade. Precious. Just beautiful. Is that, I guess that's, is that a nightgown or is that a? Yes, it is. I love that. Yes, it is. Just like something Caroline Ingalls would. Yes, it does. Yeah. Yes, it does. And she's always loved dolls. My grandmother loved my granny. She loved dolls. I love your violin. I've got one of those I found not long ago. She, um, that, is that, what, is it a mandolin? Or is it a mandolin? The other one, there's one of them that, yeah. yeah. She yeah. bought that local just around the block from someone that was that. selling it. And then Kayla got her the Little House book. Is that not sweet? I had that, and I said, I've got yes, to give that, that to Miss Mary. My, Mama loved it. She said, I'll put it with my baby dolls. They're reading it to each other in their, in their baby bed. Because that's where they are, at their little mm -hmm. house. And did you make all these little curtains, Miss Mary? Or? No, 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 no. Uh-uh. No, I, I, I bought, got them down at, uh, when they had the uh, um, sign shop at, uh, used to be Bennett. Yeah. I found them down there. She loves sewing machines, too. Yes. She's got them staged here. They're yonder ways. This one right here, I've never seen one like it. And I can't find nobody to tell me, you know, how it works. Because whoever had this had to do this and sew at the same time over here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And uh, so if one of your viewers knows, maybe they can let yes. us know. Yes. Some people collect sewing machines. That is beautiful. They would have to be no, very, very coordinated. Have. Yes, they would have. But, and I'm not that coordinated. <laughs> It's all so pretty. And this Little church. Um, this was a window her brother Bill gave her that was in his old barn. I, you know, don't know the history of that either. It could be from a house in Thorsby. I don't know, but um, I just wonder if this kind of glass that used to be in here was this etched glass. It could be, and that is gorgeous. Mm -hmm, I love that. All those birds sound so pretty out there. And you said this was who now? Now that is daddy, my, my daddy's mother. And that is my dad when he was a baby and his brother, J.O. And again, my daddy and his brother and my grandmother. And that's mama's mama. That's my mother. And I don't know what baby. So that's, that's the, that's the lady who, mm -hmm. who that's this little mama. house is just yes. centered all around. Yes. That's, that's Jean. And what is this? Uh, Press or so. I'm really not sure. I don't know what it is. It's beautiful. <laughs> I love it. Whose glasses are those? Are they somebody's glasses? It's mama's glasses. <gasps> mm -mm. Isn't that sweet? Yes. Just precious. She lived to be a, a, a good older age, so she had a blessed life. So we love to remember her by looking at her things out here. And yes. that's why I love antiques and mama does too. It's just back in the time where life was simpler and yes. people were people were good to one another mm -hmm. and one of these days I just I hope we can get back to that but we know we know that it's we're all gonna be friends in heaven that's right and have all the antiques we could imagine <laughs> y'all's y'all's mansion's gonna be made of primitive Yes, because I would prefer that over gold, Jesus. It, yeah, yes, you would. Yes, you would. He knows that it doesn't take a whole lot for me to, I just, you know. It's, well, I love yeah. it all. And y'all, even the outside of the little house is beautiful. We both love flowers. We love the outdoors. Thank goodness we have local businesses that have uh, plants that are so reasonable. Yes, I love the new one in Thorsby over there. Yes, that one, and then, you know, I love Hollywood down there. Oh, I do, too. I, I, I go there all the time. And y'all, again, 
most every stick or piece of this is either a flea market or a yard sale or a thrift store. Very rarely does do either of us buy from an antique store because it's just, you know, it's just, we have a budget and we try to stick to it. And I mean, if it's something really special that we want for a big event like Christmas or a birthday, we might spend a little more, but anybody can be a collector. It's just, it takes, going often to be able to find the good stuff yes and i just found one of these I yes that out. I thought about you, the little bowl planner or the i guess you prepare your ground to put the bulb in there and uh i had just the funny thing is it sold out really quick but i had just bought one and i said mama we need some little bitty bitty tiny pots and she called me i told her what like i think it was like last tuesday she said, well, come see what I got down at the cow barn. And y'all found a these? A little old lady had that pop, that little uh, tin pan with all of those in it. What do you think she paid for? I don't know. I don't even want to know. $3. Oh, so my goodness. I said, Mama, you are the luckiest duck. Yes, she is. Cause, so, oh, my goodness. It's just, I'm tore up. I know. I was too. I wanted them to go on my, my porch. I That's know what it. We, it comes into. Hey, I want that too, but we'll share. And those little skunks. Those are so we sweet. We went to the Maplesville First Baptist. Y'all had a yard sale two or three weeks ago. Oh, did y'all get them there? We got them there. It, anything in there was $2. Oh, my Except goodness. Except they had some things that were marked. They were basically just giving it away. Yes. Oh, but my I, we've goodness. But we've never seen No, those <laughs> are precious. And that little rabbit down there, that little metal rabbit. When Rodney worked, my husband Rodney worked for Tommy Corporation in Thor's the metal manufacturing place. He cast that rabbit, and I've got a Santa Claus, but he did two or three of them. I love that rabbit. Now, he's heavy. He but, is adorable. Um, I told him, I said, can't you just have a little metal shot where we can Yes. I just love that. I'm tore up that she too. has paid $3 for I it. I do, too. I love that. And everything is so pretty. Y'all, this is a little slice of paradise. And y'all love vintage bicycles. And I do, too. Yes, we do. What is this plant that, growing? That, that is a tame honeysuckle. Oh, my and goodness. And a bird planted that. A bird planted yeah, it. Y'all, let me just tell you something. over here on the other side of the plant. She sticks a oh, stick in the ground and it grows into this beautiful masterpiece. Yeah, I can nice. go buy a plant and look. And it, it won't be. So you're a master junker and a master yeah. gardener, Miss Mary. Yeah, I try to go. Look at her succulent. I, I said, Mama, I can't grow them. I die. Look, these just have been in the yard all winter. And look at these succulents. They're just, I don't know what they put in their soil or whatever. Isn't that cute? I said, yes. what is that? She said, it's some, yeah, something that goes on a telephone pole. That is so sweet. I love it all. Is this a, one of the wild roses too, Miss Mary? Yes, ma'am. Yeah, that she says she got off the side of the road and yeah. and and planted it, and it has just grown like this, y'all. Yeah, I've never seen a blight or that those little bugs that get on them. Yes. That's why I quit buying them because I uh, like the ones you buy in the store because they don't look good. Everything is so pretty. And Miss Angie's house is out that we went and visited is off on the other side mm -hmm. over there. And our corn crib, y'all. We'll have our corn crib sale soon. Yes. Where, now, where is the corn crib? The I can't. Right oh, there it is. Yes. The same glass There's the corn so we crib. Back and forth with our stuff. So, in a couple. And y'all, we cleaned a lot of stuff out of here. Yes. Out in a couple of months, we'll come back because this little thing out there is the corn crib and she has a big old sale. We filmed it one time. Yes, you did. My little uh, grandma. Uh, baby Waylon, he's only four. He loves to watch it. Yes. That's Katie's baby. Yeah. And she's got two, and they are precious. And her eating them donuts, I was just My dying. Donuts. Yes, she, she does. does. And her loves them too, so like I said, when you, know I love them too, but she's, she had a, Angie posted a video and the baby was crying and she it said, you, every day. I'm not kidding. she and said, y'all have all, you've already had two. And she was just a squalling and she put the donut in her hand and she just quit. It was them fake alligator tears. Yep, <laughs> she had that donut. She was ready. Well, y'all, it is just absolutely beautiful. Oh, we got to do the front porch, too. Every little thing is so pretty. 
she's very meticulous and she'll she'll move it and move it around and and look y'all when they have their corn crib sales they have it staged just as pretty that's why they have she can find it and i tell her i'm the stager We'll get tickled. She'll move something. I'll say, no, Mama, who's in charge? That's right. We'll say, you in charge. We'll just die laughing knowing I'm not in charge, but I pretend like I am. And all y'all's flowers are gorgeous. I just love it all. Now, look, I can get to this up here. Y'all going to... Rodney's going to be out circling the neighborhood because they're going to be a domestic disturbance over here. <laughs> I'll be throwing stuff in the back of my husband's he truck. Say, I wish you'd come over there and get some of hers. It's <laughs> on, if you were to see his garage where we moved a lot of this for our sale, he can't even pull his lawnmower in. But I said, it, it's just temporary. Be That's fun. right. We're just sharing the love of junk with others. That's right. Well, yeah, y'all, I hope so. Because I, <laughs> me, y'all know we y'all's best customers. Yeah. Kayla are our best customers. We show up at yes. seven thirty, and we wait for them to open yes. it up, and we run to it what we hilarious. want. We, that's what we enjoy about it. Is the people. <laughs> it's our same customers that keep coming. Yes. Y'all, we just all swap junk. We should just have a thing for all of us to bring our junk. Yes. Have it eaten in a swap. Yes, bag. absolutely. Well, thank y'all so much, ladies, for letting us come. It was such a treat. Look, we are so glad that y'all came because we've seen all of Kayla's videos and um yeah. we love her stuff too so i always watch to see what she has that i might want but not nothing compared oh uh, this i said miss angie and miss mary are my goals well mama's my goal but i've told her you know the other two sisters are not junkers at all like they don't like i said now mama you know this is in your wheel for me that's right <laughs> that's right we were laughing about it. She said, you know what will happen is they'll all get interested in it. And I said, that's probably true. But just all kidding aside, this is something me and Mama love to do together. It's fun. Nobody else in our family enjoys it but us. So when I say, Mama, you ready to go junkie? What you say? Yeah. <laughs> we're, look, she, Gone she, junking. She's got that's right. And we just make a day of it. So. Well, I love it. And yeah, Mother, I love my Mama. We're so close. But she's not into the junk. But that's her, that's what well that's what my pennies for my Penny, pennies my junker. Penny, your penny is my mama. And that's, that's, we, and we feel and my mama's there for the comedic relief. Yes, yes. <laughs> so, well, thank y'all so much. I we just absolutely love it, and we can't wait for y'all's corn crib sale. And well, thank y'all for and, even being interested in watching mm -hmm. it because I love when people are interested in, in old things. Well, everybody is going to absolutely love it. And thank you, Kayla. For yes. Your time to come at any time so until next time y'all be blessed and happy junkin and we love y'all from the little house